Hello everybody and welcome to a very scuffed Baldur's Gate 3 where I am attempting to record while in an Airbnb on a bed on my laptop where I am trying to do the audio and the game and the recording on the same device that is already getting hot. The AC is also going in the background because I'm in Southern Arizona and it's only 10 o'clock in the morning and it's already 90 degrees. So if I don't have it on, I'll explode. <laughs> um, so we are attempting, this is potentially going to be, it might see the light of day. I've done a small test recording. It didn't look super great. It kind of looked a little like the, like the frames were not great, so I don't know, but I gotta, I gotta play a little bit, otherwise I'm just not gonna have enough video to be able to upload, but right now, it's been forever since I've played, but I got the, we're on our way to try to get the relic, that's Kethrick's relic, we know that his daughter is alive, Isabel, um, I thought she was the relic. I distinctly remember that. I thought she was the relic because this guy is like some weird necromancer type guy. And I don't know, is it, he's a, is the relic's in here and Isabel is not in here. So now I'm like, darn it. But I was so sure. I was so sure. I do remember that. Um, also, I totally spaced, but on Will... He, uh, he says that the, uh, abs or that, no, well, not Mizora, not Mizora, has told us that we need to get somebody, like, somebody important. Oh, also I'm sick. I don't know if you can tell. I've been sick for the past, like, week, and I'm only just now feeling a little better. Um, which is why I can record. That's why I got the Airbnb, actually, is because I was like, I'm sick, and I don't want to sleep in my car, <laughs> so, um... But yeah, we were supposed to, like, maybe get some sort of imper person asset that's important to Zario for Will. I don't know. At this point, I'm just full in. Also, I think it's super windy out because it sounds like either someone's trying to, like, break into this little tiny trailer or, like, or the wind is really going. And I think it's still Must wind. be on my way. Um, and who do we have? Okay, okay, okay. Do so you have anything to say? Enough. My oh. Creations have nothing to say. So he's the one who's been talking through them this whole time. Okay, so he wants us. We're in the Gauntlet of Shar, and we need to go find the relic. I thought I already got the Shar in provisions. Here. The relic is just like further in. Do I not have a. Do I not have. Frick, I don't know. <laughs> We're just gonna wander around. We're just gonna wander, you know? In true D&D &D fashion. Also, this is very weird seeing everything on my tiny laptop screen. I mean, it's not like infinitesimally tiny, but like, it's pretty small. I also have the graphics only on high instead of ultra in an attempt to maybe make things a little easier for my poor little computer, but... I'm not sure. I wonder if this... Yeah, there was these, because I tried to get... What's this bucket? I tried to get a Asterion to open these doors, and he couldn't open them. There's, like, doors in that room, and he couldn't open. I think that's where I'm, I reloaded to at some point, because I used up, like, all of my... Um... Oh, man. I used up, like, all my... Lock-picking stuff, and I had to reload. Orders from B. Oh my gosh, it is so windy out there. Um, I'm sure the mic is also picking up the sound of my laptop, which sounds like a plane taking off. Ah! <laughs> it's so scuffed. Seek means to access the relic. Search in the library. Oh, oh, look at me not knowing where to go and not look at this. Look at this. Thank you, DM. Do not deviate, do not fail, return promptly. It's in the library. Well, now I just need to find a map that tells me where the library is. <laughs> I guess if I find a bunch of books, maybe I'll be I'll be more um, careful. Let's see. Okay. Just curious. Is this like is there, like bloody offerings here? Oh, those are guts. Oh, hey, look, a door. A bulky door, and it will open for me. Everything. 
what's in there. This is very odd. I feel like also my controls might be slightly different on my laptop. This is my first time doing them. Oh! So soft step trial. Also, as soon as we came in, I saw this lever and I was like, hold on a second. And it's like red. I was like, Bleh. okay, I need to be careful. You need to not. I need to not walk like a maniac into everything you see. Lever plaque. Where's the plaque? I'm I'm worried the plaque's like actually behind me. Plaque. Maybe I should read the plaque. Most vaunted treasure. Uh, outside. No time to dally. All right, I'm letting you do this stuff. I don't want to do it. Do anything? I don't see anything bad. I am gonna send her off by herself though. A granite bench, an iron gate, iron gate, iron gate. A skeleton, wooden crate, bench. I know we're not, she's not supposed to be light and all, but like, I need some light. Maybe not, maybe not daylight, but we will, I think, use the light spell, which she does have. I might need to get my glasses for this. Everything's much smaller than I'm used to. So I can't afford to like linger too long on any of this because the editing is going to be gnarly on these as it is. Uh, I cannot see light because I'm blind, so I'm just going to use daylight. We have to use a level 3 spell slot for it? That's ridiculous. We can't cast it on ourselves? It has to be- no! Enchant an item to shine like the sun, or summon a sphere of sunlight. Um, well I want to just enchant her, like a weapon, like I've been doing with the light spell. But it was Karlak who had that because of a... An item. A ring. Alright, we'll just have to go dark. It's good thing she has dark vision. The bowl contains an ancient, rust-colored blood stain. It forms a neat disc, as if spilled calmly and willingly. Oh yeah? You recognize this as a trial where initiates would prove themselves to Lady Shah. This one would put their skills of stealth and infiltration to the test. Oh, so we just start it here. Off of your blood in Shah's name. I was like thinking this area was gonna be bad. But it looks like we have to wait. He values those that can remain unseen and can still obtain what they want. Stealth is a virtue derived from her very essence. What's in there? A shadow. Okay, so she has cloak of shadows. I guess it's a good thing I didn't cast light on her. Let's see. We'll crouch walk, I guess. Must let anyone see. I don't know what we're after. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna be shoved back, and I can't use it now. Was to try again. The spooky stuff going on. Oh, thank you. I'll need those, I'm sure. Hmm. Unnoticed. Good. I guess. I don't know. We'll just sneak through like a normal person. I mean, I gladly, uh,. Use invisibility or something, but oh, Ooh, run! No time to dally. 
hiding was successful, but we were lucky. Oh, I wonder if we could use Pass Without a Trace, maybe? I wish, I don't know if you can, but I wish you could like, yay. Okay. Which does, which what? It gives me a plus 10 to bonus. Oh, and then I should have, oh, um, maybe? I don't know if Channel Divinity would have, like, canceled it, but. Better tread carefully. Woohoo! Perception failed. Ah, what am I trying to do? It's too late for that now. Is that a... What, look at that! Grease? I could fall. I don't want to do that. Ooh, fire. That's bad. So I... Ooh, okay, maybe I come in this way. And I can try to disarm it. I still don't want to like get knocked over and getting into this back room I'm gonna I assume the sound of lock picking. Did she just say I love the sound of lock picking what a weirdo Yee. we do have these tools we'll try to do with these tools Wow she's doing really bad. Okay, jeez. Like, she shouldn't be that bad. I hope there was no, like, really cool armor or something. Words of daring. Man. Destroyed shout. Words of guile. Words of daring. And a destroyed one. Seek no permission. Take all that benefits you. Okay, so I'm gonna steal the umbral gem, is what you're telling me. It's broken. What do we have here? A soft step is better than any armor. Well, good thing she's wearing medium armor. What do we have here? What? Is that it? Oh, we found an umbral gem. Oh, we need more umbral gems. To enter the temple's inner sanctum, we must complete the Gauntlet of Shar. Trials made for her elite soldiers, the Dark Decisions. Well, how did this guy get the relic? Oh, he must have he must have made it way back when he was still a Shar guy, huh? The Balthazar made this relic back when Kethric, uh, Silver Fox guy, <laughs> is uh, when, when he was. Uh, uh, not a constituent. Yeah, a constituent of Shar, kind of. <laughs> we can go with that. Uh, okay. We are, we do need more. Okay, though, but we did complete something that we wanted to. And now everything's lit up, so hopefully nobody gets mad at me for sneaking around. Okay, it's only lit up in there. Oh, wait, let's see. Um... There probably isn't anything else, but I do want to check. This seems like a... Like a dead end. Yep. Okay. Well, it's a good thing we have Miss Char here. Miss, Miss, Miss Mini Char. To do all the sneaksy stuff and Char and stuff. Alright, so it's almost like the developers and writers, uh, did that on purpose. Best avoid that trap. Yeah, no joke. I'm kind of wondering if some of these are, like, false walls, but it's hard to tell. Yeah. 
she might have boots on that don't that let her not fall. I'm not a hundred percent sure. She did at some point, but that usually they're like specific for like not being in webbed or something. Okay. Let's try. The first trial completed. The first sign you are worthy. Continue. Do not fail me. Okay, mom. No one back home will ever believe this. No one back home. Well, I'm glad I didn't just miss this door. Swift as my feet can carry me. I know I kind of wandered in here at one point, uh, and I was like, nope, I don't want to do any of this yet, you know, so it's kind of hard to keep track of. There's another door. Okay, let's see if there's a plaque out here. Plaque down here. Her most hallowed mercy. Alright, Shadowheart, it's on you. You could do this without Shaw, or without Shadowheart, I guess. Ay ay. There's a great ghoulish display. Artistry. It is it clear the victim suffered greatly before dying and so being put on show. Why oh, they both free and had things to say about it, uh, but basically amounted to the same thing. Somebody died horribly. Uh, let's see, lever. I don't see it doing anything, but it, I don't think it hurts to ever uh, pull on levers. I mean, yeah, it does. I mean, you pull the wrong lever, things will be bad for you. All right. Another bowl bearing the stains of an ancient blood offering. Another of Lady Shah's trials that her initiates must face. This one would challenge their combat prowess. Combat? Uh, let's look. Okay, let's look. Vanquish your old life to receive my wisdom. Okay. Char sure is chatty to somebody who's already ostensibly past. Oh no, this is for the Dark Justicia. That's right. It's like she's past basic trials, but this is a Dark Justicia thing. Teaches us that we are our own worst enemy much of the time. Her embrace will elude us until we shed that which holds us back. Okie dokie, we're going through all. Um. What you call it? Arc for Shadowheart right now. The self same trap. I'm gonna have to fight myself. Like, as Shadowheart, I think, is what's gonna have to happen here. Hello, Shadow Me? Come on out. I failed the perception check. Cool. It is so dark. Surprise! Bye! Yeah, Shadowheart. I figured. A silence aura. That's a nuts cool. Shield of Faith. Or use shocking grass. Let's do it. Dang it. Haha, you can't scare me myself. Am I too close? All right. Easy. Umbral gem. Shadow Heart's gonna need a nap after this. I don't wanna keep going on the spirit guardian thing. Umbral transporter? That was a bad idea. Oh no, it was a good idea. Okay. <laughs> You got anything else to say, Shadow Mommy? No? Okay. Let's go. There's probably gonna be at least three trials, you know? It's kinda that's it's, I would assume. This is the way I came up last time. I didn't see anything on the opposite side. 
like, um, like this is just an open thing. There's no rooms. So maybe I do need to go to the other side and like all the way over and see if they have anything. Oh, we do have this door down here. Let's look at this. As I've been not doing my rule of, um, Worth a shot? quick saving before doors. Faith leap trial. Okay, now we're in the next one. Looks like. Uh, leap of faith indeed. Jeez. Another bowl bearing the stains of an ancient blood offering. Another trial to judge the metal of Lady Shah's initiates. This one would test their ability to navigate her sacred darkness. Sacred darkness. Navigate the darkness to feel my embrace. You know who she looks like? She looks like Charlize Theron. I don't know, something about the like mouth, something about like the jaw? I don't know, it looks like Charlize Theron. I think it's Charlize Theron, yeah. Shadowheart would yell from a measly little scratch. These were said to be sure of foot in even the darkest recesses of Lady Shah's embrace. I must remember where to step and have faith that she will guide me. Look at these light balls. I must remember where to step and have faith that she will guide me. Okay, well, how do we know where to step? You say that, but. Lever, or do I need to jump from like like this doesn't look this doesn't look walkable kind of very weird very weird there was a lever here I swear yeah it's okay where did the lever go Oh, maybe it's like way over there. I don't, I, I feel like I'm walking on air? I feel like I'm walking on air. Okay, I was like, I don't think this is, I'm just like walking where I can. Do I only get three, there were, there were three orbs and now there are two? Don't like that. Alright, maybe we get in the darkness. I can't, like, jump that far. I can't control dead, I died. Hmm. Like, dead dead? And something just this year, night weavers are mad. Hmm. I don't know where to go. Still breathing, despite everything. Oh, the door is locked behind the. Oh no! Yeah, I know. We left her in there. I was gonna say we need to revive her. Oh my gosh, this is dramatic. This is like in real D and D. Like, this is why you don't split the party. But we were waiting. We were letting her do her arc. Well, hello. Let's see. Is it a 20? Easy. Oh, figures. Oh. Oh, good. I was like, oh, no. Thank you, Asteria. All right. What now? The dark. Oh, effort. Perhaps you are not worthy of my embrace. I don't know what happened, is the thing. Like, where is. Where did you put Shadowheart? I need to revive her so that she can do it herself. Ah. 
I think she's in this. And I think we can get into here. At least it seemed like. Oh. And Halston's just dead. Okay. I'm looking it up. I have no. I don't care. I don't know how to get through this. What? You can just click the bottom right platform where the umbral orb is and your character will auto path there. No problem. This person, though, does says the auto pathing didn't work. I don't even know where the umbral orb is. Is it where there? Can I just. Can I have it? Let's see. Nope. We all die. Okay, new plan. We're gonna go. We can't fast travel in here. Uh, I'm gonna go back out. Should I spend the money on reviving them? That's a lot of money. Oh, can I bring her body back to us like that? Alas. I cannot just bring her body back. Never a dull moment. Hmm. I would. Somebody maybe mentioned just flying over? I don't think I have anybody who can fly. Okay, so the, the scrolls are 300, so it's cheaper to maybe have the guy back at camp revive everybody. I wonder if the gods are watching me. Well. Go to camp. <laughs> it's safe for everyone to go back. And then I'm gonna freaking cheat. I'm gonna. I have a fly scroll. I'm sure I have a fly scroll or a fly potion somewhere. I strike thy name. Hello, babies. Look at I'm playing. Rise. I like everybody else back at camp's like, so where's so and so and so and so? And I'm like, uh, just hang on a second. Okay, good. That's actually very worth it to have them come back at full health. In my mind, anyway. All right, thank you. Yay, now we can go back. Gonna save. So I don't want to waste this potion of flying if it's not gonna work. My poor laptop is like, it's actually doing really well, honestly. I'm very pleased with it, with the I recording so far. Like Who knows, I'm gonna go edit the recording and be like, oh, it's crap, and you guys are gonna be like, what is this? It's gonna be like a PowerPoint. Um, let's do this is working so far. I'm freaked out though. We're already down to like six rounds, so I'm like, but it's a pain in the butt to have to end the turn on everybody. But flying is working. Oh, we didn't click the... We get to restart the trial, I think? Oh, man. Now I gotta freaking reload. Or actually, let's see. Um... Oh, come on. Let's see if we can just have a Asterion do the blood offering. Bearing the stains of an ancient blood. Ah, uh, just like the I book. Have to get across remembering where the platforms are. Remembering? What do you mean remembering? I, there's no remembering. Also, she's already here. Feel my inner sanctum. The final test awaits. Okay, we did it. We sort of cheated and we did it. Stoked. Absolutely still. I was gonna say, oh no, I gotta like time her back, you know. I've got a long road ahead. Um, but we don't. Um Why did Shadowheart die? I thought Oh, did she just try to walk she tried to walk back, I think. Is that blood? Oh no. no never mind. Hang on, hang on. Let's see. Her most sacred path. 
I was like, why did we teleport back? I think technically because uh, Shadow Heart failed. Listen, I've got money. I don't spend it on. I don't really spend it very often. Let's just bring her back. Hurry up! I say hurry up. But he's like. He's not even doing necromancy, he's simply undoing death. Which it's like, haha, yeah, of course you have an undo death mechanic in a video game, but in the game lore, this guy has to be a god. Like, this power is only. It is godlike. Okay, and Shadowheart got inspiration, I noticed, um, from doing it. And now we apparently just have the final trial to do, which is probably in there. Um, I am going to call this one here, however. Hopefully this episode worked. If it didn't, we'll just have to go from there and see how it goes in the future. Just see how things work out. Um, we might have a big break of Baldur's Gate, which is unfortunate because I want to finish the dang game. But such is the nomad life so i appreciate you guys for putting up with me i know i don't upload very often and especially with, with it was doing better when i was like living like doing winter break but now that work started up it's gonna make things hard so i appreciate your patience i know a lot of you are enjoying this stuff like enjoying the stuff i'm uploading but i know many people are just kind of waiting for dreadwolf to come out like i am so here we are in our dreadwolf waiting, waiting room for the last 10 years so I want, to, I want to rename my channel the Dread Wolf Waiting Room. Ten years plus, <laughs> you know, not ten years yet, almost. Um, but yeah, thank you all for joining me. I appreciate it. Really, quick, I want to say thank you so much to my patrons. Like truly, I know because I don't upload very often, and I just appreciate your guys' support regardless of that. Truly, it it helps a lot. It lets me get the little things like this Airbnb. Um, so I do appreciate your guys' help. So thank you all again. Uh, to everyone, including my Acorn Tier patrons, thank you, Fane, so much for your support. I very much appreciate it. I want to give an extra special shout out to Reese Galito, my Sapling Tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. Also, I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my Forest Tier patron, who has truly gone above and beyond in his support of me and the channel, and who I cannot thank enough. So, thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.